Celebrating 20 years of excellence, the Orange County High School of the Arts continues to offer one of the top four academic programs in Orange County, based on an API score of 868. Founded on the belief that creative artistry is fueled by intellectual insight, the school is widely awarded for its dual arts and academic programs. We are very proud to feature a few of our most distinguished national and international awards and highlights from this school year. 2006 No Child Left Behind Blue Ribbon School, U.S. Department of Education. International Network of Schools for the Advancement of Arts Education's 2006 Exemplary School Award recipient. Dr. Ralph O. Pasek, 2007 Excellence in Entrepreneurship Award recipient, Orange County Business Journal. As one of the premier art schools in the nation, the Orange County High School of the Arts is the place for bright and talented students to flourish in one of 11 arts conservatory programs. A student body with a common goal can create amazing things when working together. This year has been marked by a series of more than 100 outstanding performances and events, all designed and supported by talented production and design students. The school's premier performance group, Montage, provided show-stopping entertainment for winter shoppers at the annual Fashion Island Tree Lighting Ceremony at Bloomingdale's Fashion Island in November. The group was also selected to perform for the Festival of Children, National Education Association, Ford Motor Company, and other prestigious organizations throughout Southern California. Honoring the past 20 years and celebrating the future, current students and alumni joined forces in a dynamic showcase at the new Renee and Henry Sugerstrom Concert Hall in Costa Mesa in January. Additionally, this year's gala fundraising event, Masterpiece in the Making, was the most successful to date, raising a record-breaking $709,000 in support of the school's award-winning arts education programs. This year, Ballet Folklorico students worked with critically acclaimed dancer Juan Talavera of Flamenco Bravo and performed his choreography in the school's 20th anniversary celebration. The students will also perform in Pacific Symphony's 2007 Mexican-American Composers Festival at the Irvine Barclay Theater. Classical and contemporary dance students received high-caliber instruction from Colleen O'Callaghan, former dancer with ABT under the direction of Mikhail Baryshnikov, and Stephen Hyde, former principal dancer with the Royal Winnipeg Ballet. The Creative Writing Conservatory's Ink Blot earned a superior rating from the National Council of Teachers of English. Creative Writing faculty also received prominent recognition. Tim Power's new novel, Three Days to Never, published by William Morrow, debuted at number 15 on the Los Angeles Times bestseller list. Abby Loomer sold a feature-length script to the Hallmark Channel, and Mindy Combs signed a prestigious contract to write the life story of longtime Disney executive Jack Lindquist. Commercial dance students pirouetted next to Nick Lazzarini, the first ever winner of Fox TV's So You Think You Can Dance in a Masterclass, and also performed pieces choreographed by Jim Kolb with the Long Beach Symphony Orchestra. The Film and Television Conservatory screened its Cineplex, featuring original student films, at Chapman University's Marion Knott Studios. Integrated art students had the opportunity to explore the art of sculpting in a master ceramics class with faculty member Randy Au, participate in a dance intensive with innovative celebrity choreographer Tim Stevenson, and take a musical theater workshop with Christine Remigio, who played Kim in the Broadway production and national tour of Miss Saigon. The award-winning symphony orchestra collaborated with internationally renowned conductor Sean Newhouse and Australian composer and former violist with the Berlin Philharmonic Orchestra, Brett Dean. The orchestra performed the world premiere of compositions by Dean and German composer Hans Joachim Hespos, who created a piece specifically for the school's symphony orchestra. The guitar program made a successful debut this year and was selected and featured in the National Young Artist Showcase at the Loyola Marymount University Guitar Festival. Students in the Pianist program have learned from renowned guest faculty such as Antoinette Perry from USC, Anna Grinberg from Chapman University, and Thomas Lymanstill from the Interlochen Conservatory in Michigan. The Jazz and Commercial Music program had the unique opportunity to perform with legendary vocalist Barbara Morrison, and renowned wind conductor William Nichols led the Frederick Fennell Wind Studies program through an amazing year. His enormous experience, including studying with Frederick Fennell himself, has expanded the WINS program in repertoire, quality of presentation, and training of young musicians.
Music and theater students sang with Phantom of the Opera and Broadway actresses Terry Bibb and Karen Culliver in the annual Performing with the Pros and studied side by side with Seussical star Kathy Rigby in preparation for Seussical, the musical. Opera students had the rare opportunity to attend the technical rehearsal for Andrea Bocelli's Amore tour this December at the Honda Center in Anaheim. Students were able to meet the conductor, Steve Mercurio, and baritone, Luis Ledesma, in addition to meeting legendary artist Andrea Bocelli. Also this year, they had master classes with visiting artists such as artistic director Henry Aquina from Hawaii Opera Theater, international baritone Luis Ledesma from Andrea Bocelli's Amore Tour, and also Joseph Basqueta, artistic director of Fresno Grand Opera. Advanced level production and design students received exclusive insight from the Blue Man Group's production team in a question and answer session and sound check at Universal City Walk made possible by the Grammy Foundation. Ansa Ami, a fashion design company based in Milan, Italy, selected 20 fashion designs created by visual arts conservatory students to be incorporated into its 2008 spring-summer line to be sold at Bloomingdale's and Macy's. Two students have been hand-picked by the designer to participate in an expense-paid summer internship in Milan, Italy. In an effort to continue to enhance the school's arts and academic programs, the Orange County High School of the Arts Foundation announced its long-term vision for the future and named 22 prominent Orange County leaders as members of its new advisory board, chaired by Orange County's Philanthropist of the Year, Paul Folino. In an effort to help execute the Foundation's long-term plan, these strategic and community partners have joined the advisory board, including dignitaries from organizations such as the Orange County Performing Arts Center, Pacific Symphony, South Coast Repertory, Opera Pacific, Pacific Chorale, Orange County Museum of Art, Philharmonic Society of Orange County, Bowers Museum, Chapman University, USC, UC Irvine, and Cal State Fullerton. Earlier this year, the school unveiled its state-of-the-art Ingram Micromedia Resource Center, which enables students to combine theory and practice through the use of technological resources, helping them to be successful in today's challenging and competitive marketplace. This new Ingram Micro Media Resource Center is now being used by the majority of our students on a daily or weekly basis. Successful alumni of the Orange County High School of the Arts are making their marks in the arts and entertainment industry and at prestigious universities throughout the world. The school's Alumni Association fosters education, fellowship, and support between the students of the Orange County High School of the Arts and the school's alumni, who frequently return to the campus to share their creativity and expertise as guest artists and as master teachers. Chad Doric, a contestant on NBC TV's Grease, You're the One That I Want, and Lindsay Mendez, who has been cast in the Broadway production of Grease, recently returned to the school's campus for a special pep rally performance. In addition to providing unparalleled opportunities in the arts, the Orange County High School of the Arts is committed to serving the diverse population of students from throughout Southern California and giving back to the local community. Through Camp OSHA, the school's foundation provides beginning level arts instruction to students in grades four through six residing in or attending schools in Santa Ana. The foundation's California Arts Center program enables children and adults to experience the amazing effects of the arts through evening, weekend, and summer classes. We'd also like to take a brief moment to thank and recognize the parents, community members, staff and faculty, and of course the students who have made this school the amazing place it is today. This year, we have received nearly 2,000 contributions from people like you in support of our arts conservatory programs. It takes an extensive network of generous and dedicated individuals like you to continue offering our students a premier arts education. Every dollar you contribute makes a significant difference in the lives of our students on a daily basis. Thank you for continuing to partner with us in providing your child with the very best in public education and for being an integral part of this masterpiece in the making. <laughs>